Hi, my name's Matthew Robert Payne. I've written over 55 Christian books. Some people write books on how to be a successful author and I've written five books <laughs> or ten books. Uh, I've written over 55 and so uh, that gives me some experience in the matter. So this is uh, a video that I'm calling uh, Indie Authors Taking Your Readers to Another Level and I turned my eyes because I was reading the title. So as a writer, whether you're a Christian writer or not, uh, perhaps uh, you're a psychologist, perhaps uh, you're uh, a psychiatrist, uh, perhaps you're a life coach or a business consultant, uh, uh, advertising guru, uh, um, business development coach, whoever you are, what you want to do if you're writing a number of books is to take your audience on a journey to educate your audience, to uh, bring them into a new level and thrust them into success. In order to do that, you have to have the keys uh, to that success. You have to have the keys that will unlock doors for them, for them to travel through. So you have to have something uh, that you can teach. And it's just not theory. Uh, many pastors I've found teach in churches uh, subjects that they're not actually walking in, they're not experienced in, and they read a book or a couple of books on a subject and they think that they can teach other people's material. And I'm sure in life coaching and business and economics and in many uh, disciplines, people may be teaching other people's material. And uh, you'll find uh, that, uh, you know, people do their doctorates uh, studying something but they don't have practical experience in the subject so they just read and read and read and quote other people's books and I've found as an author when I see someone quoting everyone else's books it tends to say to me that they don't know as much about this subject as they think they do so uh, it would be your aim to, uh, it would be a good aim anyway, uh, for you to take uh, people from point A and get them all the way uh, to point D, uh, showing them step by step how to develop and progress and move uh, through the level. So if you are a world champion chess player uh, and you had the ability to teach and instruct, you could probably do a master class on playing six successful chess. Uh, if you're a writer who's written 55 books, uh, you could probably write a few books on how to write a successful book and how to engage your readers. And that's what I've done. This is my third book on writing. What I found with uh, three testimonies so far of people that I know uh, who have read my books, uh, they're all friends that I've talked to on Facebook phone. Uh, they weren't friends of mine, but they contacted me after reading my books. 
And what I've found with these three, I've talked to face to face over Skype and Zoom and Facebook phone, is that each of these people's lives have been totally transformed by my writing. This is, uh, as a writer, you want to hear that. I, I think it is really special uh, to get testimony off a person to say that their life has just gone to another level. Uh, as I'm speaking and sharing in this video, I'm getting more and more testimony uh, come to my mind that it's four, actually five, actually six uh, people that I know have been transformed. One of my uh, friends, uh, Nicola, who I write uh, books with, I've, I've co-written three books with uh, interviews with Michael Jackson, Mary Magdalene and Enoch. Uh, she, she said about a year ago to me that, uh, you know, she's, she's gone up three or four levels in a faith walk in, in her intimacy with Jesus, with her uh, ability to see things in the spiritual realm, with her ability to communicate with God. Uh, with with her faith level, uh, she was communicating that it radically changed her life, and uh, that her life is completely different now because of who I am. I've been fortunate that the Holy Spirit has been my inspiration, and for you uh, who aren't Christians, uh, that may. Uh, uh, be different to something you've heard before, but the Holy Spirit is just simply uh, the essence, the spirit uh, behind who God and Jesus are. And he's inspired me uh, to write. Uh, I've got a friend uh, uh, called Lisa Townley who she uh, went on a trip to India uh, from America and on the way back from India she traveled all the way to Australia just to spend a week with me just to show me how much I was loved so here's a couple her, her and her husband traveled all the way to Australia paid the expense to come to Australia and return just to show me how much uh, I was loved and she says her her whole life has been turned upside down, has, has been radically changed. And she's gone to another level. I got a friend in South Africa who says his whole life has been changed. Uh, his name is Paul. And they're both Paul and Lisa have written a book uh, similar to mine called Getting Right With God. And uh, I was taught with uh, a former counsellor how to uh, journal with God in this three-stage sort of journal. Uh, Lisa read my manuscript and uh, started to journal that way. And when she'd written 30 journal entries, I published, I paid to publish her book on the same subject. And Paul did the same thing and wrote a journal and I paid to publish his book. So not only have I encouraged people, but I've actually been used to uh, publish their books for them. So it is so encouraging uh, to be a teacher, to be someone who teaches people the principles of the Christian life. It's so encouraging to have people say, that they've gone to another level. They've gone through several levels of uh, understanding since I've been reading your books. It's just so exciting. It's just so rewarding. Can you put a price on it? Uh, can you uh, put a price on uh, the intimacy, the closeness that people have uh, grown uh, with their relationship with Jesus Christ. Can you put a price on it? Can you put a price on love? 
uh, can you measure and uh, put a specific uh, quantity of money uh, forth uh, that would uh, uh, pay, which would uh, uh, effectively measure uh, how much they've grown. I, uh, as you know uh, from previous videos and uh, elsewhere in, in the book, uh, that this is going to become, uh, I sell my books for 99 cents on Kindle. And if, uh, if, if, if Amazon allowed me uh, to make all my books free, that'd be free. I am a big believer in getting the message out. Uh, I understand that uh, when I get to heaven, I'm going to be rewarded for how many people came to Jesus and how many people grew closer to Jesus. And uh, I'm going to get rewarded for the impact I made on earth. And so I'm after those rewards in heaven. I'm not really after monetary rewards on earth. So how are you? What do you know? Do you think uh, you can change people's lives? Do you think that you could teach them something? Uh, do you feel that you could equip them in a specific skill set with one book? Or may you plan it out over the course of five to ten books? Have you got... Uh, you know, these are things you want to consider as an author. Do you want to write uh, one 400-page book or would you be better suited writing a series of 10, 60-page books and breaking down each of the specific subjects, writing a really specific book on each of the 10 subjects? Uh, you could uh, try and uh, put it in... in uh, a 600 page book or a 400 page book but would people learn more if they read six or ten specific books on specific subjects this is just how this book is coming to, together I'm just being inspired uh, by the Holy Spirit uh, to write on uh, to do videos on specific subjects addressed to indie authors and I'm hoping that uh, YouTube will uh, put my videos in a good place and they seem to be putting the first three in a good place uh, on YouTube so people can actually uh, watch them and learn. People can out of maybe there'll be 20 or 25 different subjects, they can specifically pick the subjects that they are interested in. So some people who may come to this book uh, when it's uh, published as a book, uh, if there's 25 subjects, maybe 15 of them really apply to them and the other 10 uh, was uh, not of much interest to them. So uh, I want to ask you, have, have you got an understanding of a subject that you could almost do a university course on how to practically uh, apply your knowledge. Have you got a skill set that you can teach people? And rather than one book, can you write five books in a series that goes deeper and deeper and deeper? Do you think that you can teach people something in such a way using so many illustrations and so many stories and expanding things so much that you make it simple in a step by step by step, book by book by book, book one, book two, book three, all the way to book 10. Do you think that you could radically transform a person's life? Have you got knowledge? Have you got secret knowledge that if they read that series of 10 books, they'd be as good as you? Of course, we need experience. We need practical experience in anything that we do. Uh, there really isn't many subjects that you can just pass on theory. Uh, you need to practically 
walk it out in your life. But have you got books? Uh, have you got a subject that you can take people through multiple levels of understanding? Have you got book one on the basics, uh, book two on intermediate, book three on uh, profound and advanced understanding of the same knowledge? Of course, you could cover the whole lot in one book, like I've said, but have, can you break down your subject? Can you break down your subject into 10 or 20 books? Not so you sell 10 or 20 books, not for a monetary gain, to break it down so simply that people can uh, uh, go from one stage to the next to a deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper uh, stage of growth. Are you able to do that? Have you got the ability to do that? Before you write your first book, uh, have you considered maybe writing three books in a series, uh, planning out, plotting out your book, uh, preparing your book, and uh, taking them from simple to intermediate to advanced? I'm so pleased uh, that I know four or five people uh, who have testified to me that their lives have been radically changed. But I'm uh, no different to who you can be. I just simply know the Christian faith uh, really well. Uh, but you probably know another subject really well. I know you, you probably started this book or you started uh, this video series thinking that you really don't know a lot, but you may find you know a lot more than you realise. And uh, so I encourage you uh, to think about taking people to a new level, uh, taking people into a new level of experience. Write a book for people who uh, have no understanding of your subject as an appetizer. Write a book for people who are in the first six months or the first year of study or the first, um, first fundamental understanding of the subject. Write a book for people who have uh, done the whole course and are looking for practical examples and stories of how to implement the knowledge that they have. And then write a book from the experience of 10 years experience and the deeper things and the more advanced things. I just want to give you ideas. Uh, my books uh, cover a whole lot of different subjects, but uh, they can be boiled down to uh, uh, how to develop a close relationship with Jesus and how to practically uh, become like Jesus on earth. Uh, why, would, why would I spend $1,500 to $2,000 to publish a book to teach you these things and, and charge 99 cents? Why would I make a loss. Why would I spend all this money to teach you? Because if I teach you properly, if I teach you how to do it, if I share with you the important steps and the important factors in producing one book and a series of books that will take people to another level, then I get to share in the reward in heaven for what you do for people, even if you don't make it to heaven. I am investing in you. I am spending my time and my money to invest in your book, to invest in all the books that you write. I'm hoping that when you read this book that you'll be so encouraged that you'll go and write a series of books to, to develop people, to take people to another level. And when you do write those series of books because you are motivated by this chapter in the book or this video, when you do write that series of books, I, by God upstairs, am going to be rewarded for the effort that you put in. So, you know, even if just one of you uh, change 10 or 20 lives, it's worth my time to teach you the fundamentals of how to do something that I do so well. I've done it, now you can do it. 
And uh, I encourage you to go forth and uh, plot out and uh, get an understanding to yourself. How can I take this one book and make it into five to ten books? How can I do it? Now, don't concentrate on making money on ten books. Don't concentrate on, uh, on trying to make more money and create a following and all these marketing things. I can tell you if you if you got 500 pages worth of content and uh, you make it into 10 books, 50 page books each, uh, the editing cost will be the same as if you made one book and 10 books. It's just your cover price and the layup of each of the books uh, will add money uh, when you when you're doing. Uh, 10 books. So it'd be more expensive for you to do 10 books, uh, but uh, it, it'll be better uh, for your readers uh, that uh, you've done that. Uh, so if you like this video, you thought it was helpful, press the thumbs up. Uh, if you didn't like it, press thumbs down. Uh, if you like this video series, there's a playlist uh, called Indie Authors uh, on my playlist on my home on, on my home page, you can look uh, under playlists and find the series, find the other videos. If you like this video, subscribe. If you subscribe, press the little bell next to it. Uh, feel free to comment. Feel free to write to me at my website. Feel free to friend request me. Uh, send me love, 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 and thank me for everything that I do. And that'll make me very happy. Okay? I hope you learned something from this video. God bless.